Noah's Adventures on Legacy Farm presents. It, I'm a little bit nervous about getting the ranger down here, but I know that will be safe, so I'm just walking down here, running right now. <laughs> it's that hill, so steep. Oh, they come. <laughs> Whoa, gosh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, everybody, welcome back to Noah's Adventures on Legacy Farm, and today we are going to go check our walnut and maple taps. The weather has not been very uh, cooperable uh, since we put them out. So I already have checked them this morning and they looked very good. So hopefully we'll get at least one five gallon bucket out of them. Hopefully we'll get at least something that's actually like good. Cause this might be our last day to tap. And right now we've only gotten one uh, little bottle of it. I've so, had a couple bottles. <laughs> oh, Mom said we had a bottle. So, okay. I don't know. So yeah, we're just not driving. much. <laughs> yeah, not much. So, it's been too cold and then too warm, and back and forth. So, we're checking our the walnut taps first, and then we're gonna go up and check the maple taps. Uh, two days ago, this was all full of water. Uh, all this right here. This whole ditch. But yeah, let's check these first. I don't think these had really anything in them. I think this one did though. Yeah, 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 yeah. Nothing? No. A lot. Sir? Good, good bit. What's the color on that one? Fine. I don't understand why that one's clear and this one's brown. I oh, know. Real precise about like perfectly clean. And, <laughs> nah. Now we just. Now I am curious though about dumping that one. Yeah. Just dump that one out. I don't get the color. Goodbye. Lid. Got it. Uh, I put some decorations on our ranger today. They look kind of cool. <laughs> Okay, we're at the others. This one is gonna be pretty shocking. But she's full. It's full? Oh yeah. Really? Yeah, I wanna. Uh, well, this one's not really done anything, right? This one are dry. These are there's a lot in all of them. Oh, I told you. Okay, well, Look at that one. Look at that. That is like Wow. Wow. I wish That's, they were all like that. I know. Nice. Wow, we might get more than a five. Pretty minimal on this one. We've I'm Mr. Filmer. Hey, that's fine. I didn't go down. This way today when I checked them, I was just a little bit freaked out because we had like two inches of rain the other day. That wasn't fun. Uh, 
climbing up on our maple taps right here. <laughs> we made it. All right. Okay. Let's see what we've got. These three. A little bit. Yeah. About half a piece, probably about half full. That's pretty good. Very good. Oh, hear that drip? Bring <laughs> it up here. Oh, yeah. Good bit in there. Really nice. Really, really nice. At least one pancake's worth. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no joke. Have you explained how we get about 40 or 50 to one? Uh, uh, what is this? Like 40 gallons? 40 or 50 to one, yeah. 40 or 50 gallons to, equals to about one gallon yeah. uh, of actual syrup, which is not much considering <laughs> like all of this. I mean, this year we we probably now we've only been tapping for a short amount of time, yeah, a week. But as Noah was saying, it's not been good. Yeah. So what you were talking about is basically because of the way the weather's not been very good, we probably only gathered probably about maybe fifteen gallons somewhere around there of sap. Yeah. Which does not amount to a whole lot. <laughs> no, not at all. And we've no. already eaten a lot of it. Yeah. I, I actually ate uh, this morning with my pancakes. I ate uh, last year's. What? Yes. I mean, we gotta keep some from like this year. I mean, we can just have like. I normally don't make it thick enough. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. This is a pretty good one. I mean, it doesn't have a ton in it, but it's got a good bit. Got a good bit today. Yeah. Um, but then, man, they're, they're forecasting like 70. They're doing a little bit of comparing. Yeah, this one that's a couple gallons, and this one that's two and a half, maybe. So you're close to five. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Nice. Really nice. Pretty good today. Pretty good today. Where are you walking to? Just a gate. Right. Uh, this tree is, we think it's gonna fall over. Uh, we're not sure. back at home and this is I'm, I wanted to show how we cook down the sap so we already had a couple gallons in the fridge that I collected the other day and it is already going good um, but we are going to sorry going to uh, add what we got today which is about five gallons that's I guess very well correct boiling down our sap. I'm going to put the rest of this into these two pots here. It's really, uh, really steamy. Um, let's get a strainer. Dad wants a little bit in each one, so I will do that. Oh, that hurt. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> okay. Well, I need to suck a bit for that. We got about a gallon right here. Gonna pour in. Woo, that's steady. Uh, put 
glitter in this baby. The last of it. See ya. It's going down really good. Okay, like some stages, but you can tell it's gotten darker, way darker in color. So yeah, this. Okay, so we had to make a little bit of a run. We were out of propane. So we had to go to a gas station and get some propane, but changed that out fine. So I forgot all about the GoPro filming that, so that's okay. But they're going good. Really good. So this is gonna be good. Um, but I am going to try to hit that out. By the way, it's gotten very windy. See, scoop the you scoop the soap out. See, it's kind of soap. It's technically foam, but it looks like soap. So, like all the bugs and stuff. Like there's an ant right there. I'll get that in the soap. Okay, I am back with the syrup, and look what we got here now. Woo! It's boiled down a lot since I uh, filmed last. It is doing really good, really good. Like, wow, this is awesome. Um, but yeah, it'll be done, uh, I don't know when, but It'll be done eventually. As always, Daisy always has to be in my videos. Say hi. Say hi. Yes. Say hi to the GoPro. Please. Okay. No oh, good girl. But yeah, this is doing really good. Okay. Back. We're still outside. And Dad is going to pour all of this into one. Hot and <laughs> hot. <laughs> um, and we're gonna pour all of this into here. So basically, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna pour it into here to strain it one time, and then I'll pour this one back into that one um, to kind of double filter it real quick. Because right. this is, did you get this real quick? That's um, getting close. Yeah, that's close. It's almost ready to go inside. Yeah. Gotta kind of do it fast so it doesn't turn to sugary. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and as always, this happens every year. It's windy. <laughs> when we do sap, when we cook sap down, it's always windy. Now we're gonna pour it back into that. Do we need to light this? Sir? Do we need, Ow. <laughs> do we need to light this one? Yeah, we will. Just gotta get some in there first or it'll hit it. It can burn. And it gets strained again, so it doesn't have to be perfect. one hand. <laughs> there you go. Oops. Good. We're good. Too bad you don't have smell o vision smells good, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. Smells like syrup. Okay, we are about to move this inside. Yeah. Uh, 
Look at that. That looks awesome. Oh, wow. Little windshield wiper. <laughs> I need one. Let me turn that on, then we'll take it in so it's already a little bit hot. Turn what on? The stove. Okay. Gotta turn the stove on. I think it's gonna be good. Nice. You wanna get the door for me when I come in? Sure. Okay, bringing it in. Mmm, it smells awesome. Oh, yeah. hours I have no clue <laughs> Little... exaggerate but I think probably at least four yeah that's not real far off yeah. and it's obviously really runny but that's yeah. not so yeah all right so have you explained this before okay so what we have to do is get it to 190 no 201 we have to get this to 201 to stop it um, and we got this candy thermometer and we just wait for it to get up and check it every 10 or 20 yeah, minutes well no more frequent than that you gotta yeah. stay real close yeah in the first probably the first 10 minutes you're okay yeah but once it starts getting anywhere close you really yeah gotta keep your eye on it because it turns really fast and that's why i overdid that one the other day mm -hmm. i cooked too much moisture out of it yeah but we just gotta stick this in here once that all gets strained out and we will uh, yes, this is the begin last the time inside we, process. The last time we filter it is right here. Yep. Whatever bugs and dirt and tree bark, eh, it's okay from here. <laughs> yeah. You would regret it pretty quick. Yeah. It's pretty. It's yeah. very dark this season. I know, it's so dark. Um, to be that color before it's done is very, very good color. It's yeah. pretty. It's different every year, isn't it? Yes. I don't really understand what makes it do that, but it's different. Yep. But it is. About to put it in, it's gonna start. <laughs> what is that? Is that the rag, the cloth? I don't know. I hope that. All right, the, let me hit, come over to your left. Then. I hope the medium might pick that up. All right, go ahead. Okay, putting it in. We're obviously not even boiling yet, so yeah. But you want to try it. to hook it so that this little bulb is in. Yeah. Um, you can slide this hole oh. down. Shoot, it's almost at 150 already. Well, I mean, it's crazy hot. It's just not hot enough. Okay, we are almost done doing sap. Um, making our syrup. It is very close. It's almost to 200. It's very, this is not at 200 though. It's about 194, 195, somewhere around there. Yeah, 193 or two close. Yes. You're not going to get much. I should probably get a smaller bottle. Yeah. Um, but this is. Yeah, we've got a smaller bottle. boiling awesome so we're about to pour it in here here we go I'll let it cool just a tiny bit and let all these bubbles settle yeah and you'll just have the liquid mm -hmm. and obviously you've got to be a little bit careful this is like scalding hot 200 degrees plastic. sticky yeah, very hot and sticky. See how it's bubbling? Nope. 
There we go. Look how it does that. See how it just breaks down all of a sudden? Oh, yeah. Well, there we go. Here's what five gallons adds up to. Hmm. It's going to fill that one full. It is. Oh, that's a good color, too. Beautiful. That's almost all of it. We might right need there. a big one. I probably could have used that other one. I didn't think we had enough for that. Oh, nuts. Oh. <laughs> Let's get a jelly jar for the last. Okay. A little bit. Okay. You gotta be real careful. This glass gets crazy hot. Mm -hmm. So, so, so fast. Look at that. Nice. Okay. Here's the last of it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we got a good bit out this round. Mm -hmm. Sugar content's really high this year. It's really good. Now watch how this does that. Watch how it hardens up like that. Look. See how it just hangs there? <laughs> this that's stuff so right here. Ooh, that's good stuff. You gotta let it cool though. I always like to put a tiny bit of water in. So this is the full process of how we get, collect and boil down our maple syrup. It, we actually got a good bit out of this round, which is really good. Oh, look how pretty that is. That's really good color. That's it's beautiful. Look at that. That looks pretty. But um, this is the full process. This is how we do it, uh, step by step. This is the full process. And this is how we turn five gallons of sap to a jar and not even half of a jelly jar of syrup. So I hope y'all enjoyed. Goodbye.